Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Dad Games Badly. Uh, we're here playing something a little different. I believe we're playing Ironsmith Medieval. Uh, gonna go ahead and play this. Uh, I'm gonna get the tutorial done here today and then get into the prologue. Uh, it's a new game that has just come out. Uh, really just like a little demo. Uh, kind of really excited. It looks like there's a little bit of story to it as well. Um, so we'll go ahead and learn the mechanics here. Oh, there's our journal. Well, that's good to know. There's a skill tree. Let's take a look at that here quickly. So you're a smith. That's all you great. What do you got over here? Master of tools. You're making the best tools in the city. No, 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 perfect. Uh, skill tree mining. Time to mine some ores. Wow. Uh, da, 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 da. Negotiator one and two. What's this one? Copper. Nice. The copper is your way to make gold. And then steel. Okay, so we can get iron, copper, steel. And we can make big swords for big people, halberds, and master of swords. Uh, armors. Wow. Can be obtained. So even like. Cannot be unlocked. Cannot be unlocked. So, can I get that? So, basically, you can get level one of everything, it looks like. Yeah. Wow, that's pretty cool. That's still quite a lot for a game. Uh, fantasy, what's this? Perks. What? Basically. Okay. That's, yes, I understand that. What do we got here? Arcane knowledge, too. More perks. Armor perks. Wow. Nordic perks. What's this one? Okay. Oh, there's quite a bit there. How do I get out of here? Okay. H to open help book. I to open your inventory. Ah, oh, and you can customize your smith too, that's cool. So our apprentice, we've got $200. Alright, so I guess we gotta talk to this dude over here, you sir. Wow, that's, uh, do I have feet? Interesting, okay. What's up, Baron? Hello, this is the testing area where you will study the basics. Let's go to the table with materials and tools. Sure, man. Yes, sir. Oh, am I in your way, sir? Jesus. What's up, dog? Pick up the hammer and pincers and some materials. So, uh, this hammer, these pincers. What's this? Um, we'll worry about handles later. Don't need those pincers. So I need five coal. And one. I mean, I'm just gonna pick it all up, right? All right, dog. What are you doing over here? Uh, did you get everything? Yeah, dude. Dun, dun, dun. God, I really hate my setup. <laughs> uh, that's not helping anything either. All right. Alright, please follow me to the furnace. Yes, sir. Okay. So, I. Let's see. 
his forge up to 1600 degrees, drop the coal in the woods in the forge, then heat up with the bellows next to the forge. Okay, on my way. To be in the Unipros, use bellows. Forge going. I'm gonna make some coals. Yes. I'm gonna take the sword from the take form from the table and go to the workbench. Uh, yes, sir. Oh. Are we still good over here? stuff. I like it. it on the bench. Q. Jeez. <laughs> Alright, let's open this up and take a look at what we can do. Uh, small blades, the thunderbolt, the leaf, bobbin large foot. I like that 18 inch. Thunderbolt is also 18 inch. Kind of like that one. Let's confirm that. Yeah. All right. Let's take the form. Let's talk to this guy again. Break the mold. Understood. Where do I break the mold? Back on the workbench. Have to interact. Uh, where's I picked up a hammer earlier? Did I not? Huh. I guess not. Maybe I dropped it and I had too much stuff. Alright, that one doesn't want to overcome. That is okay.
All right. Well, it's taken forever, but just figuring out the controls. There's a lot going on, and I don't even know if jumping is faster. Whew. There we go. To the anvil now. Boom, boom, boom. I don't want. What do I need to pick it up? Oh, there we go. The red dots to forge steel. Skated off there. Beautiful. Where is that workbench again? Excuse me, Baron. Okay, so I need a guard. Okay. Let's go see what this guy has to say now. And I go to the table and I have to take extra ingot, put it in the furnace, and when it's hot enough. Anvil, metal rod, split it apart, or fish, come see you afterward. Alright. I love how the Baron is teaching me. It's not just like, you know, an actual blacksmith. You're not apprenticing under anybody. He's just telling you what to do. Oh, man. I guess I could have put it on there to heat it up like a dummy. <laughs> oh, that's exactly what I wanted. Um, Alright, and it is still early access, so it's gonna have some bugs, but otherwise, it's still pretty good. You need a blade or ingot on the anvil. I have an ingot on the anvil, do I not? Uh, 
Oh, it doesn't have enough heat. That's my problem. I'm not put it on you. There we go. Or not. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of fuel. Goodness, I thought it was heated. My apologies. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Probably because I've been running around with it, too. Alright. There's a lot going on in this game. And I need to pay more attention. We will wait until it's 100%. as fast as you can to make a hole. Perfecto. And those should get heat treated. Take a handle from the table. Uh, we did see those small handles right here. Probably just because I can't do that. Watch this guy. Does he have anything else to say? Okay, so now I need to assemble all the parts together. Do it by clicking on them in good order. Remember to take the handle from the table as it's not made for metal. Or the large sword, need large handle, medium, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yes, sir. Alright, guard. We're going to put the Nordic guard out there. We're going to put our small handle here. On that wolf pommel. Now let's get assembling. Click on the blade. Okay, click on the guard. Yeah, stick that on. Click on the handle. Oh, yeah, like that guard is perfect for this sword. Sometimes you do, you, people like to do. Uh, Off to the side, wolf head pommel. Yeah. Sorry, Baron. Here, because we've never been up here. 
out these for the handles and guards if we were lazy and didn't want to do anything. Uh, engraving table. Oh. Alright. Let's take it. Ugh. Sorry about that, it's just it, quite jumpy. Um, but again. Uh, let's see. The pommel. Let's see. We can go around soft. Around. Why? Why? Why would you do that? Kind of wish you could just get like a wolf. simple one. And the guard. Round works because again I definitely like round. And the blade. Well oh, exquisite. No, normal. No, it's just not gonna have any cause why would you? Uh, watch. Oh, so it's like Step is to polish and sharpen your sword at the grinding wheel. That was over here. That's quite the process. I hope I can uh, automate this later <laughs> in the actual game, because that is a lot of, like... Jesus. Alrighty. You made it. The sword is ready for battle. Put it on the racks and get come get your money.
92% quality, that's not too bad. Kind of like to see a little bit more customization options. Uh, just with like the engraving and stuff. Maybe if you could kind of do it yourself. Pull the lines, resize, rotate, you know, that kind of thing. Maybe that would work. Alright, here comes the end of the, ba of the basic tutorial. You can have some fun around here while waiting for the early access version soon. And go play the program of the story mode. Well, we're definitely going to go and do that. Uh... Alright. Well, guys, thanks for coming out for this one. Uh, this looks like a really fun game that uh, I'm going to definitely be getting into a little bit more. Uh, as you can tell, I kind of like some of these mining and smithing games. Uh, I definitely thought about getting into smithing at some point. So we will leave this one here. Uh, we will come back to this one again uh, and go through the prologue together and kind of see where the story goes. But I don't want to ruin it.